Come on. Let's go together. Let's see what Yusuke got to say about this. That's enough. Damn. What the f Look at Anne really getting emotional over this bullshit, bro. Lady Anne's holding back her tears. She's totally empathizing. Look at everybody else in the movie theater. It's like me when I played God of War, bro. <laughs> I was f***ing Kratos for some moments. Gonna move this a little bit closer. Okay, that's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? And welcome back to another Persona 5 Royal video here. In the last video, we saw Madarame confess um, he went to jail or whatever. I don't know. We, yeah, I think he went to jail. I think he got locked up. Um, and so now we have a few days till, uh, till finals, I believe it is. Final exams or exams, something like that. I don't know. Um, and we're gonna celebrate at the firework festival or some shit. That's what, that's where we left off. <sighs> what a refreshing morning. How are you doing? I had a smile on my face till your bitch ass showed up. I didn't expect the phantom thieves would suppress a man <clears throat> that even the police had trouble with. Okay, why is this dude started. why is this dude teaching us just are coming up everyone's studying i know some of you rely on all-nighters but i can't recommend it that really messes up your information retention oh speaking of do you guys know the difference between short-term and long-term memory the simple answer is that short-term memory more me memories more temporary contextual but long-term memories stick with you <clears throat> I don't give a fuck, bro. What do you think about all this? Short-term memories only stick with you for seconds at a time. That said, how long do you think memories you can return long-term memories? Oh my god. How long? Maximum infinite. Let's go. Give me my knowledge so I can talk to fucking yeah, I don't care, bro. What are you going on about bullshit? I don't care about. Give me my knowledge, bro. Thank you. Damn. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry if this shit is actually intriguing to you guys, but I don't care, bro. Go play the game if you want. I'm. Uh, let me. I'll stop. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. At least you got summer break once the exams are over. So do your best to study, okay? Yeah, memories never really go away. That means I'll remember my past. Shut up. Don't nobody care about you. God damn, two classes? 718, Marine Day. I don't send in the 16th. That should be good, right? <clears throat> what are you talking about? The fireworks festival? You're really quick to look up stuff like that. Impressive, Ryuji. Don't get back to studying. It's easier to work when you got a goal in mind, yeah? Hey, we were in the middle of class. Talk about those things later. Yeah, yeah. Hey, are you listening? <clears throat> Oh my god, why is it always you that be on my ass, bro? You don't have anything fucking better to do? How about you teach the class? You, pay attention! Is that how you listen? Uh, don't throw- Good shit, good shit. Thought he had me, thought he had me, good shit. Good shit. Good shit, let's go. My charm has increased, I got two charm from that, let's go. That's what we like to see. It takes a long ass time to get these fucking skills up. Jeez. Hey. So you wanna sit up here and walk up on me, talk to me, but when I fucking come to talk to you after you literally said I'll be at the principal or I'll be at the fucking student council room, come talk to me whenever we could chill. When I fucking come over, you you are not interested because I'm too stupid for you. I have to get my knowledge to point level three. But you wanna just walk up on me anyway? Fake ass, bro. You're so fake. <clears throat> Heading home? It's rare running into you at this hour. That reminds me. Do you remember the counseling Dr. Maruki's offering? It seems to be growing quite popular. I saw someone heading into the nurse's office just as I was leaving the school. The teachers say he's been well worth the, his time here, but I have a feeling there's more to his popularity than just talent. <sighs> Maybe I should find out for myself at some point. I don't care. Why are you telling me? <clears throat> what about studying? Naturally, it'll still happen when I get home. It's part of my daily routine. Excuse me. I appreciate your concern, but how about yourself? Depending on the exam scores, there may not be a fireworks festival for anyone to attend. Were you aware? You're not my mom. I'm joking. But make sure you study well, alright? Alright, keep the all same right, keep the same energy when I come talk to you at the fucking student council room tomorrow. Fake ass motherfucker, bro. I need to buy some more test prep booklets on my home. See you later. 
<clears throat> Senpai. I can't. Can I go home? Can I fucking go home? I don't want to talk to any of you guys right now. I don't even want to talk to you right now. Can I just go home? It's. I've been fucking walking around this entire day. Look, it's sundown now. What? What a pleasant surprise. Are you headed home too? Yes. For the last three hours. Same here. I don't have club practice today. Then go home. What are you talking to me for? That reminds me. There's <clears throat> something I wanted to report to you. Would now be a good time? Not like they give me a fucking option here. Not like they give me an option. Not like they give me... They don't even give me an option to say no. Yeah, short thing. <clears throat> Thank you. Why don't we find a seat somewhere? Right here on the floor. Huh? And why the fuck is this dude here, bro? And you are... Don't worry about it. It's been quite a while, Akechi-san. You know each other? Hold up. And the same for you. Yoshizawa-san, right? They know each other? You know- you two have history? <laughs> what? My father works at a TV station. Have you ever seen Good Morning Japan? My father's the director. No. Don't know who he is. I've been brought <clears throat> to the show as a guest a number of times now. <clears throat> Excuse me. That's how I ended up becoming acquainted Sorry. with Yoshizawa-san. <clears throat> my, my, like, I- I just- It's allergy season, bro. A lot of pollen outside. I didn't know you knew her as well. Oh, trust me, I know her real well, you know what I'm saying? She and I made a deal. She's my friend. I, I can't friends on her. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. He's been offering me guidance lately. Yes, sir. <laughs> a deal, you say? Huh. That's quite the interesting relationship you two have. You jealous? Ugly? So, what were you two up to? Nothing, none of, nothing with you. I was just about to share some exciting news. You don't need to tell him all this. It's nothing to keep secret, so I may as well spill it now. Oh my god, bro. About that summer competition <clears throat> I mentioned to you before. Why is this dude still here? I was chosen to be our club representative. I don't care. Congratulations. Congra you, I mean, congratulations. I'm so proud of you. Good job. I don't care. You did it! Yay! <laughs> this only feels like the beginning to me, though. I don't care! Isn't your club's team considered to be quite prestigious? And you're their <clears> representative. <throat> I must say, that's extremely impressive. Thank you. I'll do my best to make everyone proud. I'll be cheering you on as well. Yeah, cheer her on from the fucking grave, bro. Ah, I have an idea. Since all three of us are here, why don't we go somewhere as a group? No, you were never part of this. We can call it our little celebration for Yoshizawa-san's success. This dude is a cornball, bro. I hate you. That would be wonderful. Does that work for you, senpai? No. Oh my. That settles it. Give me an option, game. Mind if I chose the place? There's a wonderful little cafe <clears throat> I know about. I'm about to turn this shit into GTA, bro. Of course. Lead the way. Oh my god, I, now I'm stuck with- I, If it was just her, I'd be cool, but now I'm stuck with this fucker. Yoshizawa-san? You drink hot beverages even in the summer? I have to prevent my body from getting too cold, since the meat's coming up rather soon. I see. <clears throat> you make sure you're covering all your bases. I'm not even- I'm not even a part of this conversation. Look, I'm trying to- I'm trying to butt in here. Your drink's just as hot? Your drink's just as hot. People say coffee can cool you off, even when hot, so I try to avoid that, too. I had this image that you enjoy sweet things, Akechi-san. Is that untrue? Now she hitting on him, bro. I don't fucking- I don't trust these girls anymore, I bro. I saw you eating fried <clears throat> sweet bread on TV just the other day. It's all part of a marketing strategy. That sort of stunt is an easy crowd pleaser. You seem to have your own bases covered as well. Can I talk? I'm here as well. Hello? Look at this. I feel lied to. Presenting oneself in a favorable <clears throat> light is nothing surprising. I'm trying to join the conversation, bro. Just how innocent you seem to be. What are you talking about? Look at you. You look like the most... You look so fake. He just gives off fake energy, bro. I've been wondering, how do you two know each other? I wish we didn't. His social studies class visited the set of a TV show I appeared <clears throat> on. Ah, that's right. 
I'm taking my shoes off. I'm wearing some Jordans, bro. You guys want to see my Jordans? Exchanged our opinions during the shoot, and his way of thinking intrigued me. It's my school colors, you know what I'm saying? Shout out. I'm not gonna. <laughs> I don't. I'm not gonna say the school name. Ah, oh, fuck. You can figure it out though. I'll just put it. You can figure it out. <clears throat> I can definitely see that. Senpai's take on things often helps me as well. At least you're not calling him senpai. That reminds me, Yoshizawa-san. You had mentioned that he's been providing you with some guidance. What's it? Why do you care? Yes, like you just said, his way of thinking is intriguing. I figured I could benefit from his input. Lying. So you know, you know why you wanted me to help you. You, you know why you wanted my guidance. You just want to, you just want, you just want to smash. I get it. In that case, let's play a little game. Not with you, bro. What do you? Nobody says let's play a little game. You hear him, bro? Like he just sounds like a creep. Creepazoid. Would you mind if I pose the same question to you that I first asked him? No, go right ahead. So, my question was... How do you feel about the Fano Thieves, fucking nerd? What do you think of the Phantom Thieves, Yoshizawa-san? She don't even know what they are, bro. You mean in the case that they do in fact exist, yes? I admit that the assistance of others in need is a truly great act. So you see down, she with it, bro. But I simply can't agree with their methods. I see. Care to explain why? I suspect the Phantom <clears throat> Thieves' existence isn't going to be beneficial to society in the long run. It's not the long run. It's however long this game is. By the looks of it, it's fucking long. Well, for example, <clears throat> when someone's faced with a problem to overcome, I believe they need to do it themselves. Fair point. Getting help from others is totally fine. But in the end, it takes a person's initiative to truly create lasting change. Fair point. If society relied upon a safety net like the Phantom Thieves, I worry that people would stop making a conscious effort. Fair point. Granted, this depends on how severe the problem is, and it's inaccurate to apply generalizations to an entire population. A lot of fair points here, I'm not even gonna lie. But I believe a society where everyone simply leaves matters to the Phantom Thieves wouldn't last for very long. See, so in the sense of a person's growth, their actions actually hinder it. Quite an interesting take on the matter. Let me ask you then, what do you think of Yoshizawa-san's opinion? Not too bad. She's not wrong. It's a unique, it's a unique stance. It's a unique stance. <laughs> Quite. I'd say it's equally as unique as your own opinions. Wait, could you actually be a fan of the Phantom Thieves, Senpai? I'm their number one fan, this dude said. I didn't mean to start an argument. I just can't help myself sometimes. He's so fake, bro. That he's he's his whole face is just a fucking. He's just a, it's just a layer of deceit, bro. Let's change the subject to something a bit lighter. I'm sorry. I should probably get going. Let me go. Let me go. I, you know what? Yeah, it's about time for me to get going too. I'm not about to get if stuck I'm here. away from home too late, my parents will begin to worry. I gotta get out of here too. Right. Then let's call it a day. Thank you. Good luck on your competition. I'll be rooting for you. Yes, thank you. You're welcome. Well then, see you later. Alright. I guess you just ruined that entire fucking evening. Ah, uh, uh, you're, you're back. back. I see you had your friends over for a study session, huh? How'd you know? Nothing gets by me. I own the place, remember? I can tell what goes on here just by looking at the tables. I don't care. <clears throat> Exams are such a downer. I'm already bummed about tests coming up. I'm in trouble for anything that's not English. I haven't been studying at all. Been. Been searching all along. Oh, maybe we can make some progress if we keep an eye on each other. Want to study together? Let's study. You're a big help. Then let's meet at the diner. That diner again? Why can't we meet at my place? Or your place? Where are th these motherfuckers gotta live somewhere. Where do they live? That long sentence is tough. Try to think about what the underlying section means. Are you starting to understand how to dis dissect these problems? I'm trying to dissect you. Yeah, I, I think so. I'm so jealous you get a one-on-one -on -one study session with Lady Anne, Chinese. Seems like you're making more progress than usual, too. Knowledge? Give me some knowledge. 
Right? Yeah. God damn, how much fucking knowledge do I need? That's not it. I'm actually not so good at this because of my time abroad. Anyway, time to study. Here we go. Do you think you could help me with the ma with math next? You see me personally? No. I'm so tired. Let's stop here. <clears throat> I'm fucking terrible at math. Then again, who's good at math? Nobody's actually good at math. If you're good at math, it means you have no life. I said it. Hey, did you know that there's gonna be a summer festival in no Badai Beauty? Summer festival, huh? How can anyone eat so much fatty food when it's so hot out? Man, you just don't get it. It's because it's hot out that we eat all the meat. Come on, let's go check it out. I'll treat you to a skewer. Oh, you're the student council president, Nijima-san, correct? Excuse me. Sorry for coming by so suddenly. It was nothing. Oh no, everyone's permitted to stop by whenever they like. I know the phrase counseling session can make some people nervous, but don't be. Considering you're the student council president, I'd rather they didn't force you to come here at all, actually. No. I was advised to come, but I still chose to do it on my own. Good. Good. Glad to hear it. But please, there's no need to be concerned about my being here. Feel free to discuss anything with me. Uh, I'm still yes. trying to find her voice. I'm still trying to find her voice. It sounds too similar to Anne's. I'm still trying. Sending more like the counselor in here than I am. Thank God I don't have to hear all this bullshit. Excellent grades, exemplary conduct. Wow, you appear to be the ideal honor student. No. Not at all. In fact, quite the opposite. I'm actually a bit of a mess, and I always have to turn to others for help. Well, you sure had me fooled. Even still, getting help isn't a bad thing at all. In fact, it's wonderful that you have a support system. Indeed. Especially lately, I feel like I can't do anything right by myself nowadays. One second. Hello. Can I send you a photo? I had to send my mother a photo. Of my driver's license. You didn't need to know that. But now you do know that. Did something go wrong for you? Yes. Yes, but it's nothing major. I've come to understand all too well that it's a bad idea taking on more of a burden than one should. Hmm. You really seem... You really do seem like someone with a mature sense of responsibility. However, that may be why people around you, especially the adults who should be protecting you, rely on you so much. <sighs> adults who should be protecting me? Had I been clever enough to understand that earlier, things may have gone a bit differently for me. You think so? <sighs> you live alone with your older sister, I see. Pardon my saying so, but it seems you've been through quite a lot. But... Honestly, it only felt like the norm to me, but our lack of adult guardians has to have been hard on my sister, even now as well. What the fuck is going on? What is going on with my with my bank right now? Talking with my representative right now? What the fuck's going on? I just click yes. I don't know what's going on in my bank, but I just fucking cashed in a lot of money, so I've, I better not be getting finessed. What the fuck's going on here? Let me just make sure I still have my fucking money. Okay, cool. I'm like, bro, <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> Our lack of adult guardian has to been hard on my sister, even now as well. And I'd be lying if I said it wasn't hard for me too. Do you still remember them? Your parents? Yes. Hey, so Not as much about my mother, admittedly, but my father without a doubt. In fact, now that I think about it, I may, have, may well have grown to be a bit uptight because of that. I see. So Desne. And are you doing okay now? Is your support system adequate? Uh, it's not as if I have a team of employees or anything, but I do have people that I'm able to re rely upon well. Of course, I'd never think of them as replacements for my father and my sister. No one could replace either of them. What I've lost won't ever come back. I just need to keep my chin up and push toward my future. Thanks. I like the way you put that. No one can ever be replaced, yet we need to keep pushing towards our future. Should anything come up that you want to help with, I'll be there to support you. Though my skills are pretty limited. <laughs> Thank you, I appreciate the kind words. Alright, some filler. Teens are coming up. Have your studies been going well? I can give you a general idea of what they were like when I was a second year. What do you think? Want to study? I don't understand this chick, bro. I asked to hang out with you like fucking five days ago and you said no. Now all of a sudden you want to study together. Yeah. Alright. What the... F 
what? So do I not need the knowledge? Is she, what? She goes like this. Anyway, now solve this problem using the formula I just taught you. Do you understand, Chinese Kun? I think I can do it. <laughs> I don't want to piss her off. Seems like you're studying a little more efficiently today. Let me get that knowledge up. Yes, sir. I got three knowledge. Let's go. So now can I hang out with you on the regular? Without you having to... All right. Scholarly. Let's go. I agree. Impressive, Chinese Kun. You're a quick learner. This is actually a pretty good review for me as well. Well then, let's move on to the next problem. I'll see you later. Well, I think this is a good place to stop for today. Alright. Ah, uh, you're, you're back. back. It's already pretty late. I guess I should head home. Who's texting me now? I already stu- I just fucking studied with Makoto. Brian's studying with your ass? Alright. Let's see here. <clears throat> the angle C and angle A was angle of B and E. Mm, what? If angle C is 28 degrees and angle A and D are 88. <laughs> okay, hold on. Yeah. I'm getting the calculator out. Alright. Angle C is 28 degrees and angle A and D are 88. So C is 28. I wish I could... And then... A and D. Are 88. What is the angle of B and E? <clears throat> B and... Okay. <laughs> it looks like about 40 degrees. 64. Ooh, we can do this. 64. Let's go. Mm. This looks tough. Origin of Baozi. Zhu Liang. Okay. Heads. Yeah. Master Strategy just came up with the Baozi too. Hello? They're not my responsibility, first off. I didn't get the damn fish, so I, I'm, I can't... A lot going on. Offer them instead of heads. Yep. Done. Done with our first... Ah, Time is up. up. Give it up. <laughs> I had to teach it like that. Shout out to, uh, Coach... What was his name? Schoonover? Now oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's an inside joke. Only middle school homies would get that. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hey, hey, sit down! Or whatever he would say, bro. I forget what he would say. I was a fun- that- yo. <laughs> what was his name? I forget his name. Shunover? I don't know. I don't remember his name. This is second- alright. That's a snow crab. That doesn't look like it'll work. Fuck. Let's go, let's go. We're acing this fucking finals. Yeah, uh, yeah. It's finals, right? <laughs> Yeah, bring that beat right back. Bring that beat right, 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 right back. Alright, I gotta focus. Raining witches. Raining cats and dogs. Ooh, we can do this. Yeah, uh. I can't fucking freestyle because I gotta focus. Witch of Fong is another name for the sound for the Suma Noodles. Yeah. That doesn't look like it'll Fuck. Work. Damn, I didn't do too good on, on that. My Japanese exam. I hate the way they, <laughs> they fucking cut the beat out and then bring it back. That shit is so stupid. Just keep it going. Yep. I, sh I only missed like two. I should have mailed this shit. I should have nailed that shit. I missed like two, bro. My parents are gonna <clears throat> kill me. There was so much stuff on that exam. I didn't have time to study everything. Skill issue. I probably could have managed if I had an extra week, too. Exams are finally over. Uh, I'm so exhausted. Uh, I can get back to actually sleeping in peace. Don't act like you weren't sleeping in peace anyway. You did not study, bro. Hmm. 
You must have been studying pretty hard if it kept you up at night. Nah, I was up playing video games. Exactly. Slacking off is just too much fun. <laughs> I know, right? <clears throat> I kept cleaning my room instead of studying. Cleaning your room. I might even be too clean now. That's not what I do when I'm bored. <laughs> you two are perfect exemplars of what escapism can mean. <sighs> and I can only imagine what the end result will be. Whatever. It's over with now. Who cares about that anymore? Facts. <laughs> It's not feeling when I, whenever you finish an exam or a test, you're just like, hey, it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? It's over with now. I don't give a fuck. I don't care that my grade was ass. It's over with now. I don't have to worry about it What's anymore. Real important is the Phantom Thief's popularity. <laughs> Ain't it amazing? It kind of feels like our time's finally here. I've even heard people excitedly <clears throat> speculating about our next target. We will have to choose carefully. There's no need to hurry. We should spend some time thinking it over. We gotta go after that one chick that was hacking our shit. Hold up. She probably listen to us right now. Now is our celebration party. I hope you guys didn't forget. It's the fireworks festival on the 18th. That's all this dude has been talking Guess about. Good meeting up in Shibuya, yeah? Let's say 5 p.m. It's kind of sure late. On top of these kinds of things, but where have you been? Been searching all. It's gonna be Ryuji. Hey, <laughs> Sorry for calling so late. I wanted to ask you about that summer festival. You remember the one I told you about? Let me sleep, bro. Come on. Come on. We're all tired from the test saint and shit. But just give me a sec. So like I completely spaced on it until now, but the festival's tomorrow. So you wanna go? I think uh uh, uh fine. <laughs> yeah. I knew you'd be down. Let's make sure we invite Yusuke too. He's always down to chow. I did just remember they said it might rain tomorrow though. Man, eh, whatever. No way it's gonna rain on a day like this. See you tomorrow. <sighs> How would he know whether or not it'll rain? All worked up over a silly little festival full of food of all kinds. Well, I suppose you deserve to enjoy yourself, but be sure to keep a low profile. <clears throat> it's so hot. It looks hot. It's as if we're walking around in an enormous sauna. And this dude is in jeans, bro. You're, to be fair, you're in black. You got black. Like, why are you wearing long sleeves? Whose bright idea was it to come here? Yours. Yours. And just look at that crowd. Smiling faces everywhere you look. Does it look like I'm smiling? With that, let's move <clears> right <throat> into asking some of the visitors here for their comments. Let me guess. You can come right over here. TV crew, huh? let, let me go hop in there. We can't end up on TV. You better not stand out. We should grab our kebabs and get out of here. All right. Ah, let's interview those three. <laughs> hey, is she talking about us? I'm camera shy. Go away. What do we do? Just say you're camera shy. Just make a run for it. That would just make us appear even more suspicious. Bro, you got a better idea then? They got us. Just li you don't have to do this. What the fuck? They're just like, oh no, nah, I'm alright. I'm actually just camera shy. Thank you. I'll have a good one. Just fucking say that and end it. Oh, hell. You don't have to do it. Okay, I'm gonna ham it up and make some real cringy comments so they can't use any of the footage. Bro. Hello. It sure is hot today, huh? Just be like, no thank you, and move the fuck on. You don't have to say yes to this shit. Oh, for sure. <laughs> yeah. And if it's this hot in July, can you imagine just how insane the weather's gonna be in December? Uh, anyway... Since you're here for the festival, does that mean you and your friends there are meat lovers? What do you mean by that? Uh, I'd say that we're really lovers of fruit. Oh, and sweets. <laughs> sweets you <clears throat> just die for. <laughs> Back to you, well, Jamie. Uh, thank you very much for your time. All right, let's go. Get out of here. Oof, that was too close. That was truly cringeworthy. But are you certain that they won't air any of it? I'm pretty sure she thought there was a broadcast disaster. We ought to be okay. Why is it they're just on TV every other weekend, bro? Like, like... I mean, imagine you have this one friend, you just fucking see him on the news every other weekend. More important than that, though. It's time to get some meat! Oh, right! I can bob! If only actual real life <laughs> food stalls were even more insane. If only real life was half as fucking exciting as this game is. Standing around in this sweltering heat was rather trying. 
And almost all the good stuff was already sold out. I went, yo, Joker got some taste. He went straight for the icy. Them shits on a summer hot ass day were it, bro. Like when you would go to fairs and shit like that, or like the fucking beach, or uh, what's like the pools and shit. That little icy shit. Why is he eating it with chopsticks though? I don't understand that. I didn't even eat breakfast this morning. I'm starting to get lightheaded. Joker got some taste for summer snacks, still, summer like sweets. This seems to make everything taste delicious. How mysterious. Because we're together. What a great time. <laughs> Even with the sticky sweatiness included. Well, we came all the way out here, so we might as well go <clears throat> check that thing out. What thing? What thing? I heard they're building some kind of huge-ass stadium or something nearby. Wait, is that what it was? You don't know what you're talking about, do you? Why did you... Why are you... Why are you here? The stadium... Well, such buildings often have intriguing architecture. I'd love to see it for personal reference. Yeah, then come on, let's go. All right. <clears throat> so that's it. What did you expect, dog? They're building it. it barely even started. We seem to be premature spectators. Who's about? <clears throat> Who's about to show up here? Who's about to roll up out of nowhere? I guess this is what people call jumping the gum. Someone's about to come up in here and be like, yo, you can't be here. Jumping the gun. Eh, there ain't nothing to do here. You want to go grab a bite somewhere? Sorry, I'm considering picking up more art supplies. I have a <laughs> summer assignment to work on. Also, the summer festival drained my coffers. Coffers? Even if I did grab a bite, all I could order would be water in a hot towel. What does it even mean? Ah. Uh, well, in that case, probably ought to just call it quits for today. Hmm? I knew it. Is that Yoshizawa? <laughs> I fucking knew it, bro. <laughs> I knew. I, I was wrong about the whole "you gotta get out of here" thing, but I knew. Just, I just knew this fucking atmosphere. Someone was about to pull up. <clears throat> Don't you think she's acting strange? You know, she did mention something about a meat earlier. What? Yeah. Why is she acting like she can't see us? Uh, ain't you guys headed home? I guess in business to take care of, right quick. I guess something to do. Huh? Oh, well, see you then. Why is she acting? She yes, catch you later. She like she don't see me, bro. Senpai? Don't act. You are you serious? Don't act like you didn't fucking see me. You know you saw me. What a pleasant surprise. Yes. Uh, did you come to see the stadium too? Same here. I needed to give myself a pep talk. Something wrong? <clears throat> Sometimes when things get me down, I come here. Why? This funky ass wall? Although that doesn't really answer your question, does it? I know this may get in the way of your plans, but would you be willing to join me for lunch? I mean, I just ate, but whatever. Kasumi, I look a little rough and puffy. It may be best to accompany her. All right. was delicious i'm not paying but i just witness you sure pack you, you sure packed it away i'm always like this after a meet in all honesty i'd like to keep going but any more will end up harming my performance so meets done simply put it was a disaster I've been feeling like I'm getting back into the natural flow of things, thanks to you, Senpai. But when the moment of truth arrived, my body still wouldn't move the way that I wanted it to. Because all that fucking food you eat. That sounds rough. Yes, I've really hit a wall with this. <laughs> That's the wrong choice to choose, because now I, I didn't... I'm terrible at keeping this conversation going. Something similar happened to me <clears throat> in middle school, but back then, I had someone by my side that kept me going. Alright, so we get some backstory here. Really? I have a younger sister. We promised each other that we'd win international gymnastics competitions together. But this spring, she died in an accident. So you had a sister. <laughs> you don't have. You had. That's so why I was like, I, I was assuming that's where that was going. I was like, why did she say hi? That doesn't make any sense. 
RIP little sister. I promised her we'd take the gold for our routines across the world. But I can't stop worrying about my lack of improvement lately. I've really been throwing myself into practice. <clears throat> but I wonder if even that won't be enough. Uh, you really it's not over yet. Is this really your limit? It's not over yet. It's not over yet. Senpai. You're right. It's just getting started. I mean, said I said that six years ago. <laughs> you just keep on rescuing me, I don't you? Said it this year too. <clears throat> okay, no more brooding. No more brooding. But I'm trying. Never mind. There are still more meets left this year. I'm going to start from scratch and train as hard as I can. Thank you so much for listening to all that. All right, don't like me again. Don't don't mention now, it. Now I feel like I've been recharged, mind, body, and spirit. <laughs> well, at least my mind and spirit are recharged. The best way to stave off hunger is with some vigorous activity. I'm going to jog home. Take care. I don't think that's what you want to do, but all right. Damn, he said fuck. <laughs> Not with me. Oh, uh, you're, you're back. back. How could you, name? How could I what? He's talking about o uh, Ohio? If you're going to the summer festival, oh, how, what? First off, how did you find out? Second of all, you don't ever, if you're not invited to something, you don't fucking, you don't do this. Especially if you're not even close with them. Like, dog, you're not even close to me. Where have you been? What did you say? Been searching all along. They're showing it on TV. Something about it being hot in December, saying sweets are to die for? It's a bit with Sakamoto saying some crazy stuff. You're seeing things. Believe me, I wanted to think that. Look, my point is, next time you guys are going out to have fun, can't I come along too? I'm the fan of these producer, you know? Oh, man. Oh, my God. I want to see a movie? Shit, hold up, man. <laughs> I saw that down there. I was just trying to see what this was all about. Here's our commander photo from the Summer Festival. At least that was the idea. What the fuck is that? It's certainly evocative. Well, don't let it get to you. Shit happens. It's understandable given the heat. Perhaps your hands grew sweaty and it slipped. Next time, we'll make sure we go somewhere we can actually eat. Agreed. I'd prefer an indoor establishment myself. Preferably one with ample seating and re free refills on water. Ah, oh, that'd just be the diner again. And why not? It's a place of calm where one may also partake of delicious food. I mean, I guess. Man, all this talk about food's got me hungry. A cup ramen would hit the spot. I believe I shall do the same. Fortunately, I recently acquired some high quality bread crusts. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> and coming in clutch. You, you want to see a movie? You know, like a movie? Everyone's buzzing about the summer debut. Everyone's talking about that chick flick, Love Possibly. I ain't seen going to watch a romance movie, bro. I've already watched this movie like six fucking times to get my not or to get my charm up. I get kind of weepy, so it's embarrassing to go alone. Can you come watch it with me? The movie's huh? If you go with a friend, it might be a different experience from just watching it alone. Let's go see it. Yay! All right, let's meet in front of the movie theater in Shibuya. I've already watched this shit like six times, bro. Literally. Cause I had to get my knowledge up or my charm. The same fucking movie. I, I saw this shit like six times, bro. Look at Anne really getting emotional over this bullshit, bro. Lady Anne's holding back her tears. She's totally empathizing. Look at everybody else in the movie theater. They don't. They don't. They are not affected by this. Look at Anne. She really. It's like me when I played God of War, bro. <laughs> When I played God of War, I got into it, bro. Like, I was fucking Kratos for some moments. First is true value. It comes from love after all. I feel like I was able to learn about love. With Anne next to me, the mood was almost as fresh as the first time I saw it. That's cool that they mentioned that, though. The fact that, that I've seen it before. I like the fact that they mentioned that I've seen it before. <clears throat> I used up two packs of pocket tissues. I guess girls like me want that perfect romantic kind of love you see in the movies. I see. <laughs> Sorry, I guess I let myself get a bit carried away. I guess it's just easy for me to talk about this kind of stuff with you. Now that I think about it, that movie wasn't 
geared toward guys at all, huh? Thanks. But I'm glad you came with me. You're such a good friend. I got friend zone. Well then, let's head home. <clears throat> Hello, name senpai. Thank you so much for earlier. Why does she? I'm tired of her thanking me. Now I can give it 110% tomorrow at practice. Uh, practice already? Of course. If I rest, it'll dull my senses. Next meet, I'll make it into the winner's podium. I swear. I won't slip up again like I did before. Where have you been? I have some great news. Next time I see you, I pro searching all along. I promise. Hey. Looks like Yoshizawa is gonna be okay now. Heh. <laughs> she sure had us worried. Puts the phone back into his fucking thigh. Today's a fireworks festival. Let's meet in Shibuya at five. Hey, Makoto, are you gonna wear a yukata? I'm planning on it. Yukatas are a great part of the summer tradition. Excuse me, fuck. They truly heighten a woman's beauty. I think I will wear- <laughs> You've got one? How about you, Chinese? What? You said woman's beauty. I'll go in normal clothes, not fucking fucking stupid. Hey, I know, why don't you come out without your glasses? What's the point in that? Then I can't see the fucking fireworks. I don't know, you don't get to see fireworks every day, so it'd be sad just wearing normal clothes. I was just thinking you might want to go for a change of pace. That sounds great. You should totally come without glasses. You guys better not be late. Come to think of it. But yeah, there's a fireworks festival today. If you're going, be careful. Those things get insanely crowded. Hey, hey. It'd be nice to watch the fireworks with the chief someday. We could watch them right here at Blue Blank. Actually, no, we couldn't. Okay. I'm missing crisscross applesauce this entire episode, bro. I gotta stretch my legs out. Hot. Say, look at this cute girl behind me. The holiday means it's as crowded on here as it is for morning rush hour. Please don't take. Look at, oh, look at this. So hot. Dude, this dude. Look, all right, shut up. This dude look like a fucking Tekken character, bro. I feel like I'm being baked. At least we're not in China. Those girls are way too late. They must be taking time for them to put on the yukata. <laughs> it is such a tryhard. Why aren't you two wearing one? Because I'm not a fucking woman, bro. <laughs> I'm not a female. I got clothes like you, Kata. That's not saying, bro. Man, you look way too normal in that. That's not. I'm, yeah, why do you actually look like you'd be wearing that shit? People often say that to me. Oh, by the way, the exams. <laughs> I bet you got a big fat F on them. All right, calm down, Morgana. Shut up. <clears throat> we. We don't know that yet. Are you going to the fireworks festival? I literally saw you on the train. That's right. Why do they ask him and not us? Because <laughs> you're wearing our stupid ass fit. Wanna go together? Okay, you scared? Get your get your get your game on, bro. Go with them so we can have them, bro. Cause I don't give a fuck about them. Are we getting hit on? Who is we? Look at they are not they do they don't even realize you're there, bro. They're talking to Yusuke right now. <laughs> Come on. Let's go together. Let's see what Yusuke got to say about this. That's enough. Damn, what the fuck? You're disgracing your yukata. You should be more aware of your womanhood. This dude is a tryhard, bro. He just said fuck you guys literally in the most polite way possible. He said go fuck yourself. Damn, that's crazy. He really, <laughs> bro. Why don't you go after them then? So those are the kinds of girls you like, Ryuji. Uh, bro. Uh, well, no, what the the pussy type? You know, Yusuke's he got taste. <clears throat> he is really missing out because of what he says. That's what I'm saying. I guess, but he's more likable since he stays true to his ideals. What did I say? Definitely more than somebody I know. Oh, this shit stopped filming. I heard that Ryuji's pretty much failed his exams. Well, how could we be surprised? Oh. Mona, you little. Mona. Hey, it's gonna get crowded if we don't get going. Agreed. But man, you both look amazing in Yukata. <laughs> Talk about Japanese music. Bro, if you don't keep, if you don't move your feet, bro, right foot, left foot. Get on this fucking train. Get up out of here. Leave your ass behind. God damn, that shit is loud. You know what? I gotta keep it loud. It's, <laughs> it's immersive. 
That's how loud I'd be in real life. Fuck, it's loud. It said it was gonna rain, so I don't know why. God damn, Thor? What the fuck is he doing? <clears throat> yeah. Come on. Looks like you need help. Then yeah. why don't you go buy me a towel already, huh? Hey, it's that one chrome dome head that we saw at the park. Yeah, we we're just trying to get out of the rain, but look how crowded it is. I guess everyone had the same idea. What's up? What is she staring at? Mm, I think I just saw someone I know. I'm like, bro, what the fuck? She's staring right at the camera. She was like, I'm like, bro, you good? You mean the girl in that black car? Well, she's got a ride. Oh, time to show your skills, Mona. We need you as a car. That doesn't work in the real world. It's not possible in the real world. Goofy. My feet hurt. It's cold. The festival's been canceled. This sucks. We should have planned better. We made such a commotion with the public, and this is what we get? <sighs> Lame. <laughs> you were the one who fucking suggested this idea, I'm pretty sure. Aren't heroes that lurk in the shadows boring? Uh, I'd like to say, you know what I'm saying? Why is, uh, I gotta use the D-pad. What are you, Moss? That was a terrible dad joke. I want to change the world with a loud bang, like a huge fire. Baby, you're a firework. I can't copyright. I can't even sing that shit. They'll copyright you nowadays. That's how crazy copyright is. That easily. Come on, let your colors burst. Though it's regrettable, we should go our separate ways for today. Make them go all... All right, let me show yeah, let's go home. All right, let's go home. So you won't tell me, no matter what. Look at this chick, Sayanijima, bro. I have nothing more to say to you about that. Talk your shit, Sojiro. I see. In that case, I have ways of making you talk. What, fucking torture? What is this, the Stone Age? What's that supposed to mean? Thanks for the drink. You're welcome, bitch. She's still bad. Hey, we're not done here yet. What's wrong? <clears throat> it's nothing. It's clearly not nothing. It's past closing time. Clean up the place. Man, you clean up the place. You dirty this shit. The cause behind the recent psychotic breakdown incidents is still unknown. That fix my hair. To other news. The international hacktivist group Medjid has released a statement to the Phantom Thieves. That's this chick right here. Mm -hmm. These are the details of the message that are posted on Medjid's website. To the Phantom Thieves causing an uproar in Japan. Do not speak of your false justice. What? We do not need the spread of such falsehood. We are the true executors of justice. Phantom thieves again? Crazy, right? However, we are magnanimous. <clears throat> we will give you an opportunity to repent your ways. If you agree to a change of heart, we will accept you as our own. If you reject our offer, the hammer of justice will find you. The hammer of Thor. Justice, huh? We are Medjid. We are unseen. We will eliminate evil. All right, try me. Akechi-san, why do you think this announcement was made at this time? It's war. I don't know the details, but there's no doubt that they were provoked by the Phantom Thieves. Whether it's a sense of rivalry or a simple attention grab, given the recent trends, I cannot say. Regardless, it's quite a nuisance. A nuisance? Both Mejed and the Phantom Thieves are nothing more than groups that uphold an egoistic justice. You are the definition of egoistic, bro. What 
stupid thing they're getting riled up on. That's what I'm saying. Phantom thieves, huh? What in the world are they? You know about them? No idea. Huh? I don't. What are they stealing though? Still having trouble getting that part. <clears throat> it's about time I go home. Alright. Make sure you lock the place up. Also, about the stuff in the fridge. Well, I guess it's fine. Just don't use too much of it. Stuff in the fridge? What are you talking about? That respect. The Phantom Thieves face a very serious crime. What? You can't even name the crime because it's it it's not real. <laughs> I made it up. That's his crime. I made it up. Alright. These motherfuckers scared of Medja. That's hilarious. Fake ass motherfuckers. And with that, I'm going to end today's Persona 5 Royal video here. Um, we got some, we got a little bit further with the story stuff. We did a little bit of filler today. Talked to some people. Got some backstories on some characters like Yoshizawa and some other stuff. And yeah, in the next episode, it looks like we're going to be obtaining some intel on Medjed. So that should be interesting. We'll see how that goes and possibly how we're going to do that palace or whatever that may be. And maybe get our next teammate. Probably going to be a catchy, unfortunately. So yeah, is what it is. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys liked the video, hit that like button. If you disliked the video, hit that dislike button. Be sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel. Cut up a sprint every single day. Working on Persona 5 Royal as well as Majora's Mask. Uh, we got Tears of the Kingdom coming up real soon. By the time this video is out, Tears of the Kingdom probably came out. So yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, folks, capture moments. Great memories. Oh, shit. I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.